Everybody, welcome back. We won as the inventor on episode 2 yesterday. Is was... the witch. We barely won episode 1. What was our secret? Ice is good. Whoa, interesting. Expect the unexpected. One spell slot contains a random spell each turn. Uh, is it our prepared slot? Because if it's, if it's not our prepared slot, that seems like a cool bonus. It's like you get the prepared slot, which will start as Cauldron, in all likelihood. Um, I get this some self-aware dialogue, yes. Um, I just like the mechanics, man. Let me in. If it's our unprepared slot, we basically get a free spell by default. What do we not care about? What the heck is memorized, dude? Nobody knows. We don't really care about a one. Go ahead, pick up the burning dice. Make my day. He will not. I gotta see what Memorize is. Replace the spell in slot doubles with the unexpected spell. Okay, so we could learn the unexpected spell. It's like getting a free piece of equipment, except we gotta invest a lot of dice into it. Nudge, dice value minus one. Let's put it on a six. Although, to be honest with you, I think nudge is pretty terrible. I don't, usually it's not very good in my opinion, especially once you actually have values that you can use for everything. On even, burns a dice. Okay. Okay. It's reusable, brother. Okay, so two burned dice. It's not that bad. It's not that good either, but it's not that bad. So what's in it? Rat. Inflict one poison. Roll a new dice. Six isn't worth that much for us, so that's pretty solid, honestly. Um, although you lose the spell forever. I don't know. That felt okay. I know, Ruka. Your your box is not that interesting anymore. Because you busted the freaking wall out. Now it's hard to sleep. It's okay, buddy. This weekend, we'll buy some mandarin oranges or something. We'll get you a new box. But you gotta stop pushing on the walls. Uh, I love freeze. Just give me ice shard. So it requires odds. Let's put it on an even. There's debate over whether or not that actually matters. You can talk it out amongst yourselves. I love the Dicey Dungeon community. Uh, like, and my, and my viewers in the community who watch Dicey Dungeon. The only downside is that sometimes people go, Hey, I love the show. But simultaneously, here's like a 3,000 word essay on probability. And I'm like, look. You're 100% right. But at the same time. Uh, I'm doing okay. Like, that's really what it comes down to. Why not? As of right now, oh, it's gonna switch anyway, but as of right now, everything's going okay. We got really lucky you rolled a one. Um, you can't do much with that. Bandage, odd. Heal one health. Not so good. So, we want to get rid of our... I think we want to get rid of our six. Became a four. We want to use our four. Requires an odd. We, we want to freeze a dice more than we care about creating Magic Missile right now. But we can still create Magic Missile. I think we can heal for one, but who cares. I think we got you next turn. I feel like we got things kind of sorted out early here. We just saved ourselves an unbelievable amount of damage there. Crystal Ball rolls three extra dice. That won't be necessary, I believe. Well... It might be necessary. We don't need a second six. Second one is actually totally fine. Hit you for three. Drain a little out of you. Roll three more dice. I think I'd rather save it, honestly. I know you're going to do two damage. Maximum. I'd rather save our ult and use it for good momentum on the next fight, I think. Ruka. Ruka. See if I can get him to... Oh, do you want to... You gotta, you gotta move over here to get on the screen, buddy. Just a little... 
Just a little. He doesn't like. He's, he's feeling a little shy. Uh, anyway, you're dead. And we don't have anything else that can heal us, so... Everything's hunky-dory right now. Honestly, here's the thing. I don't think Hall of Mirrors is all that good. I, I definitely think it's a heck of a lot better than Nudge, though. And I know that now we've got Hall of Mirrors on sixes. That's okay, because here's, here's my reasoning. I don't want to lose Memorize. Maybe one day it'll actually be awesome for us. We'll see a spell that we just love. Plus, it's new, so it's got that going for it, which is nice. Um, I mean, that's amazing. It's still amazing, just for the record. Let's, let's roll as well. Are we about to level up? Let's roll, brother. Wow, we can't do anything with it. <laughs> That's so horrible. Anyway, um, Nudge was useless for us, I think. So, my personal opinion was that we did the right thing there by using Hall of Mirrors instead. It's tricky. Actually, it's not tricky at all. We totally got you. Luca, you can't be there. You gotta be in the box. You can see the tail. It's all. It's not an elaborate puppet show, puppet show, I promise. Prepared or upgraded? Generally speaking, I think upgraded is better. Luca, you can't be there. I know you're like, my box isn't as good anymore. But you broke the box. I don't know how to explain that to you because you're a cat, but it's the darn truth. Um... I wonder what an upgraded ice shard looks like. It can take anything. It's beautiful. Give me two threes next turn. Freeze one of his dice. I think we, I think Freeze is the witch is never done me wrong. We just got to make sure we're using it against the right enemies. And if that's the case, very little to worry about. Maximum of three. It's not that big of a deal, honestly. We'll definitely roll. It's kind of unfortunate, but... Um, so, four is not that good for us unless we have a five, which we do. So, let's toss that out there. Threes, pretty good here. Otherwise, not worth that much. So, we do have shock, burn, and freeze. But I don't think that's that good for the amount of dice we have left. Um, let's use a three on cauldron. It doesn't replace the dice because it's weakened. Let's uh, try that again. Then we have an odd and an even still around. Freezing two dice. I mean, we should have thrown it because we're going to lose that spell. But freezing two dice. Sure, we get weakened twice, but we only get hit for two. That's not bad. I, I'd rather get weakened but have him in a freaking chokehold. Dude. It doesn't do any better than that. It doesn't get any better than that. Magic Spear has been wonderful. In fact, might have wanted to maybe consider memorizing it. I didn't think about that. Memorize is also kind of useless for us because I'm not I'm never using it. But the only thing I could think of to replace it with would be magic key. Which has the added benefit of giving us extra dice. And actually you know what? I think a magic key purchased placed in the memorize slot. And then, I mean, we're making a big change here. But then making magic key requires an even. We're only rolling three dice. The odds of not getting an even on three dice are only one in eight. So I'm willing to take that chance. Um, let, me, let me rephrase to make it slightly more obvious. The odds of not getting an even are one over two to the power of three. And when you get an even, really, my, my whole central hypothesis here is just, uh, this hurts. We, we want something protecting us. Um, my central hypothesis is very simple. Um, the more dice, the merrier, kind of. And we want magic missile. 
Let's start with an upgraded cauldron and just see where the see where the road takes us. To another five. And then to a three. What if you gave me a three? Split me in two? Two, four, six only, dude! Should have put it in the upgraded slot. We still burned a dice, thankfully. Four, three. It's okay. Alright. Um, so it gave me Hall of Mirrors there. It's kind of funny. Don't really like a five right now. Four is fine. Came two, two. Now I like a five, and let's put it in this slot. It's really good. It's like really, really good. Six, four. It's pretty bad. Ten more damage coming my way. Uh, we gotta be close to a heal, though. Really, we, I wish we were freezing this guy. We should have used our fours for that. We gotcha. I'm dumb. Um, yeah, I'm dumb. I meant to create a magic missile there, but I don't think we could have. I think my brain is just is just wrong there. Um, what do you got? Catastrophe. That's that's an ignore for now. Appreciate that this isn't a rotten apple. Roka, come on, buddy. I don't like any of these spells. I'll just tell you, you straight out. I don't like any of these spells. Gold Cauldron. Do one damage, you get an even dice. I honestly think if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And this run might look broke, but I don't think it's broke. I think I, I broke a little bit. Sticky hands. Do you steal something? Steals one gold. If you get 20, you run away. I gotta tell you right now, brother. You're in a world of hurt, the likes of which you can't possibly understand. You are done. What do you think an upgraded magic key does? That's what I was hoping for. Now we get one four. Four. Hit him for five. Another two. He's guaranteed to roll one one. You're not going anywhere, brother. <laughs> Oh, sir, you have been absolutely hard countered. Probably. Do one damage and get an even dice. I would like an odd dice if possible. There we go. <laughs> uh, now we just want to hit him. We don't need all these magic keys around here. Sorry, my cat's trying to get on the desk. I'm holding him back. Just, just, just stay in the box. Tomo's in the box. He's loving life. The only thing Tomo's not loving about being in the box right now is that uh, you're out here causing all sorts of, all sorts of shenanigans. You're not content with your location in life, Ruka, and that's a that's a problem. Ambition's good, but. You know, you're, you're ambitious without cause right now. You, you Surely you see how that's a dangerous situation when you're in the, the situation you're in. You will you will be sleeping in the box or outside of the room. Take your, take your pick. Honestly, I don't want to get rid of any of our stuff. So, like, I'll take duplicate or duplicate. But, uh, you know what? We could probably get away with uh, an infliction. And actually... My son, you can't be there. Why? You can. You want to be on my lap for a little bit? You can be on my lap for a little bit. So I had another, a new idea, which is, uh, hey, why not put duplicate or duplicates on this? Why would we do that? Well, um, it can duplicate. Yeah, anything high. What I was thinking is, if you duplicate a six, right out of the gate. That's right. Uh, you get more out of Hall of Mirrors. Now, do we want to shock or do we want to freeze? You got four dice. Honestly, I think we want to lower your, your count as much as possible. So we'll do it like this. So, uh, by the way, I... Oh, that's such a good roll. I know that Hall of Mirrors makes it. So if you put it on the upgraded slot, you only need an even. Half the dice will give you a Haunted Mirrors proc. 
Here's the thing. We don't need that many dice. I honestly think it's hugely overkill. That being said, okay. he's like, father, release me. Um, in this situation, I don't think it's bad. Do we want to use both sixes for this? I don't believe so. I think we want to go, uh, we might as well, doesn't matter. Because I, we don't want any more Hall of Mirrors no matter what. I think we, we like it like this. Um, and I will freeze no matter what. The freeze is still important. Your thing is double poison? Oh my god. The three poison sucks. Actually, this isn't that bad. Seemed worse than it was. Still want to duplicate our highest number, I think. I don't think, I think this is our best outcome. I don't, I don't think we had lethal there. You can crunch the numbers though. Don't let me stop you. Broken. I can live with that. Okay. So far, um, I actually feel like we're doing pretty well. There is a rotten apple for the 500th time. This is the guy we don't want to freeze. Four, four, three. We might as well get to HP first by fighting the snowman. Don't hit him with frost. Frost makes him powerful. Well, it makes him guaranteed to freeze you. Whether you think that's bad or not, I guess is a, it's up to you. Let's roll some more dice. Let's duplicate. Hit him with this. Hall of Mirrors. More dice. Um, thinking. I think in this case, we want to take a cauldron. Maybe we want to turn our six into... I was just going to say a five is pretty good. And a four is also good. But it, we don't want freeze. Uh, we have a problem now, though. Um, we can create magic missile. But we don't have any evens. So... But we don't have any evens, so... What am I doing? <laughs> what what am I doing? Um, still don't really like a six here. You know, we kind of do like a... I don't know, man. I'm just... Just roll with it, brother. I, this this could have been worse, honestly. Like, it feels like it turned out relatively well. I actually think now we just want to create this that, that was I, we did 10 damage I can live with that he did get three odds which is very unfortunate freezing would have saved us four damage in the end but it could have also given us you know like minus three damage with plus one freeze but freezing's not that bad for us iron armor sucks really bad um, we really want to get these cauldrons uh, to give us high rolls it didn't happen so we'll get the cauldron to give us some high rolls please It's weird. What's the point? I, I don't have a good answer for you. Except I, I keep doing more actions. So for me, it feels like I'm doing positive things. But I don't actually know if that's like the case at all. Either way, we somehow managed to get a lot of damage and then like a lot of dice. Or one extra dice out of it. You got three odds yet again. It's pretty rough for me, to be honest. But we are going to hit our ults, which means we can roll a bunch of dice on this turn. This will be a great turn to deal a lot of damage. Okay, so we love the, we love the magic missiles. Um, oh good, we could cure poison, by the way. Magic missiles is on five. So duplicate a four. Four. Five. Four. Rook on. Don't be, don't be such a silly boy. Let's get rid of Hall of Mirrors. We definitely don't need it anymore. An upgraded cauldron allows us to get so much... Please. 
so much extra value that we wouldn't have previously considered. Like, oh, no, no, no. Thank you. What about a magic key? We got a four and a two out of it. All right, if you want to leave, then just leave. I don't know why it's got, it's always got to be a thing. All right, Tomo. It's just me and you now, buddy. You, you outlasted. Let's duplicate our four. Why? I don't have a great answer for you. We don't really want to freeze a dice or do four damage. I think we'd rather just keep the keep the ball rolling here. I know it's strange, like, but I again, I feel like by using this upgraded cauldron, we're getting just a disgusting amount. We saved, uh, well, we saved a little damage on that. Yeah, I guess we did save four damage on that. Um, the, the cauldron is giving us just an absurd amount of value. I don't love having it early if we have other utility equipment that could do better for us, but I love having the ability to kind of ex That's what happens when you start playing on muscle memory. Oh, whatever. He reduces our health by half. It's the perfect time to fight him. Maybe I'm not as dumb as I thought I was. Anyway, start here. Enemy rolls blank, it's locked. I still think you put it here. Well, it's gonna slow his count down. Duplicated dice, do it, do it. So, here's the thing. We wanna kill this son of a gun ASAP, right? The answer to that question is yes. Um, do we want to freeze two of his dice? I don't really care, because like, if he takes away half our HP, it, it means nothing to me. Half of our HP is like, is six HP right now. It does not bother me. I think we're doing exactly the right thing, and by getting more dice uh, moving forwards, uh, This gives us what we need to get further ahead. For sure. So I think you start by maybe uh, three is not a valuable number. We want to create sixes. Didn't happen. Uh, that's okay. Let's duplicate a five. And then we're basically going to use that as magic missile fuel. Yes. Now's where it gets interesting. I think we're going to try a little two. I meant to do three there, but we can still two here, duplicate the three, pop down a three, split the five, it becomes a three and a two. Pop down the two, duplicate the three, pop down the three, split a three, cauldron. Okay, this is where you start to maybe get something. That's huge. Obviously. Why not, dude? So unless you kill me this turn, which I think is mathematically impossible, uh, we got nothing to worry about. It's not my dog. It was an interesting fight. This whole episode is interesting. I much prefer the witch to the inventor, honestly. I feel like the inventor, I just find sort of... Still very scary, actually. I find the inventor just sort of unfun. Don't shoot the messenger. Um, that's a great roll. Uh, if you want to freeze as much as possible. Um, but the witch I find more difficult, at least so far. But also more interesting. So we do want to freeze as much. We really want to do as many attacks as possible. What's the reasoning for this? Because they're weak to ice, so we do double damage on each attack. And actually, as we freeze more and more dice, um, we can sort of... We, we have to weaken you on this one, I guess, but 
We can guarantee you won't roll more than one even, which means that you are functionally completely useless. But this is a little bit touchier now. Dupe the six. We need to find a way to make a four. So one way to do that is a three into a split, which became a five and a one. Then a one. Should have casted this first. It's okay. And then put a put a five in there, I think. You get a six in return. So let's do it. And well, you might as well dupe the six. And then you do six damage and he's dead. That seems I'm still putting my frown on because I'm embarrassed they didn't see lethal. I think Upgraded has served us relatively well. What do you got going on here? I... D just don't insult me. I really like what we got going. Don't try to sell me anything, okay? Freeze one dice, roll a one. Interesting. What do you think, Tomo? I think it's an interesting setup. We want to dupe a six. Um, I love this. Put a, put a five in here. Use the one to make a better cauldron. Dump your three. Don't want to see it. Dump your one. Don't want to see it. It's a six. Pop that bad boy in there. What are you going to do with a six? Might as well just toss it, to be honest. The, the engine has started. Curse is not good, but it's not that bad. Um... I think what you want to do is start with Cauldron. That's not that bad. I'm being just completely sincere. And then I think we'll dupe A. And dupe a 5 first? This is weird. Then put dupe back down. Dupe a 6. Give me a bunch of 6s next turn. But then make a magic missile in the duplicate spot. And hit me with one of, one of these. And I feel like I messed it up. That's a terrible roll for me. We're cursed, and then, can't do anything there. Six damage, not that big of a deal. Curse is still not that bad. Now we got a lot of stuff to work with. Three, not that good. Two, whatever. This is, We're on borrowed time. Not a big deal at all. Repeat next attack, love to see it. Um, give me a two. Duplicate the six. Give me a five. Double up on the, this magic missile. Pretty sneaky. Our damage is not a problem right now. That's a good low roll for us. One frozen dice, we're cursed. Six damage dealt. Obviously not ideal. I would rather you be dead, but... Um, Let's see if we have lethal first. You would, uh, we don't have a cauldron, so we kind of got to bite the bullet and do before. Obviously, this is bad. Um, one, six. We're close, but we do need a crystal ball. Then you can do a two. Dupe a six. Toss. Toss. You still got evens you can use there. Dude, this is a creative uh, is a creative way to play this character. I'm having a good time. Now that I feel, you know, sometimes you got to suffer as a character in order to figure out how to actually play them. I got to tell you, Magic Spear taking up two slots has really burst my bubble. I don't think we need it anymore. I much prefer when it accidentally gets cast. Burns a dice, reusable. Can't dupe a two. Dupe your six. Use your dupe. Pop it here. Dupe a six. Hall of Mirrors. Am I really gonna let you hit me? Oh yes. It is unfortunate. But next turn, we're gonna have a nice engine. That's a lot of damage, brother. But that's okay. 
We got lots of juice now. Okay, so we like the dupe. Honestly, I think we like maybe dupe cauldron. This gives us a really, really nice engine. And I think you can... You might as well, if you're going to get rid of the two, you might as well use it to dupe an even first so that you can get one extra dice. And then all of a sudden, here's where you get going. Having three freeze would be awesome. So let's get an ice shard going in this slot. It's not about the damage here. Then a cauldron here. Uh, here would be better. Three. You can do some interesting stuff with a three, but that's okay. A one is also good. No joke. Get the one. Here comes a three. Let's get rid of the three. Here comes a three. That's actually the ideal roll because we got the damage out of it as well. And then, now we're freezing two dice. You're going to do very little damage to us unless you roll three high numbers, and you didn't. So, one setup turn, we did take a lot of damage, now we got them in our sights. Freeze three dice, that's kind of like, that's your gimme right there. Then, you definitely want to dupe a six. Probably. So one, I actually think you dump a six now. It's so I, I understand what you're saying is like why would you do this after you and I the answer is I don't know, okay? I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> but I do know how to lock this guy down so he can't do much to us as well. Hmm. At some point we gotta pivot. Uh Maximum three, okay. At some point we gotta pivot. We gotta start doing some damage. I think we like duping a five here, so we can get more magic missiles. But then we don't have many evens, so what you do about that... Try splitting... Uh, I mean, you can split a one into two ones. It's a little funky. So now we have all odds, but... I mean, one of them is a magic key. Needs a two or more, right? Okay, so you can't split a one into ones. And you got a one, two. Okay. A two, then you get a one, and you toss a one in here, and you reroll one of these ones. Comes a two. That's very nice. Get rid of that. It becomes a three. You get a five. You turn it into a magic missile. You cast your two. You get a magic key. You put it here. You use it. You get a three two. You get a two. You dupe your three. You get a three. You put it in here. You split it. You get a two one. You roll three dice, because I've gotten myself very confused. Something, like, you feel like you should be dead. But I recognize that somehow, against all odds, you're not. Um, and this offends me a great deal. Just, just more than you could ever understand. And yet still, you live with one HP. And the ability to do two damage to me. Ooh, more than you can do four. I only froze one dice. What's wrong with me? Sorry, it's been a long day. Gotta hydrate, right, Tomal? I still think as good as that fight might have looked, we took more damage than we had to. Against the Wicker Man, we really want to use a burn spell, but that can only show up via randomness. Counterspell. If an enemy rolls blank, that's locked. So if we could force you... What am I doing? We want a high roll, please. Better. We want to force you into low rolls. Or, in this case, this doesn't really help us at all, so never mind. Um, yeah, that was not a great start. What the heck is count? Oh, counter five. Yes, okay, I understand. Really, what we wanted to do there was freeze you and then lock ones, but you didn't really get much leverage on us, so I'm not super concerned. Okay, so we do want to do this because sixes are great for us. Um, and then you might as well two six again. Five is not that necessary, so what do we want? Getting another five is not that bad. Shock, burn, and freeze.
I don't know if we should be going for the kill yet, but that seemed pretty good for me. One damage. Five damage. Could be worse. We, we definitely want leverage, though. So, like, this is Crystal Ball. I'd rather not, if possible. Um, do me a favor. Let's dupe a five. Then we want evens. Best way to get an even would be to put a magic key out here. You're going to get four one. That's evens. Um, same is one two by default. Cast another one of these bad boys. All we need is an even number and we get lethal. Please. It's just that easy. Sort of. <laughs> I, I I am lost in the sauce. I sort of don't know what I'm doing here, but uh, it's it appears to be working relatively well. What do you do again? What's your thing? What are you about? Six shooter. You get a six, do a bunch of damage. You also get midnight charm. We want to freeze those dice. Okay. Five is the least valuable for us. The more dice we can freeze, we'd love a four one. You're too good to me. Freezing dice is the most important thing we could ever ask for. Why this way? Well, because we don't really need magic key anymore. Lovely. Lovely. This guy is very unlikely to be a threat. We gotta keep him locked down with ice, though. Which is why it was so nice to summon uh, an ice shard, honestly. Oh. You gotta love it. Same boat, like... Hook him up here. Three frozen would be ideal, but we're not likely to get there, you know? We just hope he rolls a natural one. A two is fine. He will probably get two sixes next turn, but he's got to do better than that to kill us. Um, so we want a four, yes. We need to create more dice, though. I don't know how you do that. I'm just gonna level with you. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna do this. And no, 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 no. We're just gonna see where this goes. Yeah, I think we got you locked down. He is gonna get uh, two sixes, so that'll hurt. But he's gotta be able to do this three times in order to kill us. He's not gonna do it three times. I hope that's abundantly clear. Um, so he will live, but again, it literally does not matter, because this turn from him means nothing. Unless he turns those ones into, you know, fives or fours, there's no way he's getting there, so. We also get to start our boss fight with our limit break almost ready to go. Um, so I'm feeling, I'm feeling adept, I'm feeling strong. I'm feeling like I fought you and Freeze is good against you. Or you might not be Shield Bash. Oh, you're immune to Lock and Freeze. That seems pretty horrible. Um, you only get one dice. It would be nice to curse you. Well, I mean, we can't stop you. So let's just not worry about Freeze. I'll tell you, though. Check this out. It's a beautiful start. Um, and then we will... Thing is, I don't really want to create an Ice Shard. So we'll just throw this. Uh, six. Shock six. Okay, so you're doing 12 damage. Silencing me and shocking me for six. I mean, I have to break silence. That way we can crystal ball. <laughs> um, good God. Well, here's the thing. You put a four in here. Four, four. Back to the level. Kind of the same thing. Put a four in here. Four, four. Okay. Do we want more dice? Yes. Yes, we do. Um, so we'll put a four in there. Okay. What the heck do you do now? We need damage, honestly, so... I think you actually dupe a 
five and use it to create two magic missiles. I hate to lose the Hall of Mirrors, but I think we have enough dice. One. Two damage and curse. So much better than the six. The six really threw me for a loop. So what do you do with the curse? We can probably start on a dupe. Totally fine. Um, it's actually great because now if Magic Missile fizzles, it doesn't really matter that much. Because we can just make another one. But we, eh, we don't actually need more evens. I still like the dupe, so I'm just going to throw. We got a couple of turns till things get bad, probably. Freeze four dice. It's not that bad. It, it does eight damage. It gives me a bunch of ones. Ones are not necessarily a kiss of death. They're not great in this situation. <laughs> get this out of here. Okay, now's where you, this upgraded cauldron is worth a lot. A three becomes magic key. It's not that good for us. Uh, I mean, is it better than a one? Not right now. More cauldrons is actually, I think, a lot better. Meteor. Come on, man. Come on, man. That's a little... That's a little much. We should have a chance at lethal next turn. That's six damage plus three blind dice. But this this guy is real nasty, dude. So this could be magic missile. It's cauldron. Also fine for the record. Um, this is already magic missile. So let's start there. I mean, we got you now. This could be magic missile. Not that it matters. Okay, sorry, I got lost in the sauce there. We got you! <laughs> episode 2 of The Witch went down way easier than Episode 1. I actually think it might have been easier. We'll be back to play as the Jester. Things are getting a little spicier. For now, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, if you did click the like button, it helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching. I will see you next time. See ya!